Yo, yo, what's up everyone? This is Kentanaka of Wish for Fish, giving you tips, bringing you on adventures, and taking you to the stream. I'm back on the water, and this time I'm in the Pyrenees of Spain, and whew, let me tell you, it is absolutely amazing. I was with Salvalinos, and they just won the Orbis International Destination of the Year Award of 2018. They were the first guide company in the Pyrenees, and they have well over 30 years of experience between all the guides. There are many different opportunities for fishing here. You could chase native zebra trout, you could do barbell on the fly, but they specifically catered this trip for me to chase these trophy trout. Everything about this trip was absolutely amazing. Uh, the wine was amazing, and, and I don't even like wine, so if you're a wine drinker, this is the place for you. And the food was spectacular. Every night we had a fantastic meal. Uh, the last night we had this super gourmet tasting menu that was total Michelin star kind of stuff. And let me tell you, the fishing was out of this world. I was not expecting fish like this. This is a fantastic all around fishery where you have to use nymphs, dry flies, and even streamers to get them to take. This is a wonderful place to take a significant other, even if they don't like fly fishing. There's so many other things to do. There's a spa with a massage and a sauna and a gym. There's also mountain bike tours. There's wine tours. You could go pick wild mushrooms. You could go visit medieval towns that are dating back thousands of years. And even this town that you're staying in, Aren, is 10th century and the architecture is absolutely amazing. I can't wait to go back. And a matter of fact, I'm gonna start hosting trips there next year. So if you're interested in coming with me, leave a comment down below. If you're interested in more information or you want to book a trip, just visit salvalinus.com. I hope you enjoy fly fishing in the Pyrenees in Spain. Finally made it to the water. I'm in the middle Pyrenees area. I can't give the exact location, but I'm with my guide, Alex from Salvinus, and we're hopefully gonna get some big, big brown. You can see there's some pretty big ones in the water, particularly right there. See the water. cast of practice is the reach cast. As you see, I do a little reach cast right here, and it was just enough to get a dead drift to get this trout to take. Yes. Wow. Okay. Okay. I just arrived to the hotel where I'll be staying for the next uh, several days with Salve Inus. Salvinus hat. Love the uh, Trout Magazine. Shout out to TU. Little welcome. Guide activities and recommended experiences. Gotta love the bottle of wine. Sweet bathroom setup. Look at that shower. What? And look at this view right here. Boom, I got my own little porch with a. Whoa, look at that off the cliffs. That's what I'm talking about, man. I already hooked up on some fish. Fantastic. Even better was going out to eat. Uh, the wine was fantastic. Their sommelier was great. They cured their own meats there, and just every course was just unbelievable. Today, it's going to be a little different fishing. I'm with owner-operator Ivan. Uh, today, I'm going to be using my Douglas six-weight Sky along with the Able uh, SDF. Uh, this is a 6.7. I'm gonna be using uh, my six weight. So there's some big, big, big fish in there as you saw from yesterday. 
So uh, hopefully we'll tie into some of those. So Ivan is using a seven foot, eight weight recon. And uh, hopefully we're gonna tie into some fish. And I keep going. Yeah? He was ah. chasing it, huh? Yeah. I mean, people come to enjoy the stream and, and then leaving trash, uh, I think it's just absolutely ridiculous. Um, you know, what they say is like, uh, pack in, pack out. And, and do your part. Conservation is a huge part. Uh, if you don't uh, do your part in conservation now, your kids could possibly not enjoy the stream. So, uh, I love what Ivan does with uh, conservation. He cleans up, he, he puts all this rubbish onto the side and then picks it up later. So if you're not aware what you can do, TU, which is Trout Unlimited, uh, does a lot of river cleanups. Uh, I'm sure that there's a lot of also smaller groups in your local area that does them as well. Almost like a... dry fly right here. So we caught a couple fantastic fish today. Decided to call a little early, then get some grub, grab some drinks, and most importantly, get a massage. Oh yeah. You know, after getting my butt kicked in Iceland, uh, casting an eight weight all week, and being freezing and under the elements of just wind, rain, and hail, uh, being in short sleeves is quite um, a change, and it was a much needed change at that, so. Let's go take a look at what's going on in the spa. So here I am at the spa. It's pretty much right next to where we're staying. Uh, this thing has got everything. This. Got a gym. This hot tub. Relax station. It's a dry sauna. We got a wet sauna. A bucket thing. This was a much needed thing right here. How's the massage, Ivan? Very good. Super. Much needed after today? I needed is a couple of weeks ago. Yeah. <laughs> oh. 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 
What a hog. <laughs> oh, okay, net. Net, net, net. Okay. I'm going to take a couple steps down. Oh! Got him. I mentioned before is line management. You notice how I grabbed the line right here and cleared it from the reel while I was fighting this fish because the last thing you want to do is lose a fish with the line wrapped around your reel. Yeah. I didn't see what I thought. Yeah. He has the streamer in the mouth. I think so. Yes, so, so, so. I I see a fish right there. Right in that hole right there. And you hook. You said the hook. Yeah. I was 100% sure that was the bottom. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you put it. What's that? Say that's the bottom. You look happy there. <laughs> <laughs> Good job. <laughs> okay, I am in Zaragoza, and this is. Absolutely spectacular. I'm just blown away right now. Hey, oi! He's cutting this jamón abirico. Uh, jamón abirico ham is the best. You know, uh, I might move to Spain, you know? <laughs> Man, I love this place. All right, I'm in Zaragoza. I have to go to Barcelona. But uh, I took a little bit of time with uh, Ivan to grab some tapas. Yeah. This place is amazing. I don't even know what this is, but it's amazing. So what is this? This is a local tomato, part of the season when the local tomato is growing up, and ventresca of tuna. Tuna ventresca, that is the best part of the tuna. As you know, most of you know, I usually do burgers and that kind of stuff. Uh, so this is like a real deal right now. I, most of you know that I'm a real big foodie. I love food. The fact that I could come here and eat some authentic Spanish food, that's what it's all about. Mm. 
Super simple, but super tasty. That's a good point. Best thing about this place is we didn't even order. It was the owner's recommendation of what we should order. This shrimp, the shrimp head in particular, delicious. Mm. Mm. This is lamb. I don't even know what kind of lamb, but it looks spectacular. Mm. So the food just keeps coming and coming. This is a pair. Oh my goodness, it's so soft. Oh. It's an ox. I love ox tail, so. Mm. Really tender. Very delicious. Man, this food. Out of this world. I feel like I'm uh, doing a food network show instead of a fly fishing thing. <laughs> I have to I have to show this because this is amazing and part of the whole thing for sure. What's up everyone? Thank you very much for watching. Please do go check out our website at wishforfish.com to keep up to date with what's going on with Wish for Fish as well as get some killer discounts and check out the Wish for Fish store for some sweet merchandise. If you're on Facebook or Instagram or other forms of social media, give us a follow at Wish for Fish. Most importantly, if you haven't subscribed already, please do because we're constantly updating new footage all the time so you can do so by clicking this right here. And if you're interested in seeing more, check out some of our other videos from this season's playlist. Thanks a lot, everyone, and I'll see you guys in the water.